Hey everyone, it's Vlogs and Dogs here. This channel is where I will post my thoughts in art form through speed paints or maybe animations. Um, and obviously post my cute doggo. Uh, my popo is the Pembroke Walsh Corgi and he lives up to his name, which is Bowser. I named him. Uh, here's a little information about this speed paint that you are currently watching. This is a redraw of an old, very, very old uh, drawing I made back in freshman year. Or at, at least I believe it was freshman year. My memory is not the best, but hopefully it gets its job done. <laughs> So back in freshman year, I had a lot of emotions, I guess, and I used to use art as a way to cope with them, and I would make personifications for these emotions that I had, and the speed paint that I made is the personification of one of the emotions think I ever actually named any of them. They just stood for a certain emotion or something like that. I'm not quite sure if it's weird to do that. I mean, it probably is. <laughs> but I mean, it's just something I did. If it's weird, then oh well. <laughs> Can't really go back and stop that, can we? Um, I decided that I would try and draw this as maybe a, tr a remembering kind of trip down memory lane, I guess. But as I said, in freshman year, I had a, I had a hard time. It wasn't my greatest moments. Um, and maybe I'll get into that more in a different video. Maybe an animation video or something. Or at least my try at animation. Uh, so I would draw these personifications a lot. Maybe more than necessary. Or at least I would think about them a lot. Recently, I... Uh, I noticed in my closet that I had a little crate of old sketchbooks and papers that I used to draw on and paint on during elementary and so forth. And when going through it, at first it was just to kind of laugh at my old elementary school art and middle school art. Dark times dark times but I saw this one and I kind of wanted to see if maybe I had improved since I first drew it and so that's why I made this speed paint I personally think I improved a bit I tried not to derail too much from the original design. I added color and I tried to make the line work better, I guess you could say. The original was on lined paper and this one is on paint tool sci. I just was looking around and I thought this might be fun to try and redraw, especially because I had just watched somebody else redraw one of their old artworks, and it gave me inspiration to try it. I don't quite remember who I was watching, though, so I'm sorry I can't give you a link to their original video, my inspiration video. Um, in this video, 
I try to go back over the line work to make it thicker on the outside because I really like that uh, style that I've seen. So I thought I would try to implement it and I'm trying to work more on my line art. I have a nasty habit of picking up my hand when I'm drawing lines instead of making one long steady line. I need to really work on that. And hopefully with this video I can see this progress and keep progressing further and hopefully I learn how to keep my hand down. <laughs> um, so I, I haven't really drawn or thought of these personifications since leaving high school or well, graduating high school and it was strange seeing it again and remembering as much as I could remember my old high school times and I know this like okay I know it's weird but it's kind of hopeful I guess you could say or comforting to know that I haven't thought of these personifications in years because they weren't exactly personifications of happy mo or happy emotions so I, th I hope that that means that I haven't had to deal with as much as I did in freshman year which is good by my standards and I'm sorry that this video isn't the best recording wise this is my first voice recording and I had like an outline of what I was going to do I don't really have a script just kind of an outline I'm not really good at sticking to scripts or anything like that which is kind of funny because I took a small little acting class in summer where did that go? <laughs> and I'm I'm sorry if I sound awkward. I've pe uh, talking to people or having people watch or notice what I'm doing is not the easiest thing for me. But I'm branching out because you've got to do that as an adult, and I've wanted to try doing YouTube and. This is a way I thought I could maybe do it. Um, but yeah. So that's basically all I wanted to say about my speed paint. Um, my ending like little note here is what this channel is going to be about. Really. Like I said, it's for my thoughts and for my dog. But I'll probably do a few things here and there like... Maybe some games, although warning in advance, I'm not very good at them. And if you're frustrated by people dying repeatedly for very, very stupid mistakes, then maybe this is not the channel for you. Or maybe don't watch the gaming ones. Because <laughs> I guarantee that's going to be the entirety of the video. I apologize in advance. <laughs> I I am trying my best when I play video games. I just haven't played them in years, so I'm not very good anymore. But I might post a few animation memes and maybe some animatics. It all depends on how much time I have from work. And I really hope that you continue to watch and maybe subscribe and enjoy my content thanks for watching be kind to yourself you're all wonderful people and have a lovely day thank you